I want them to be like, they won't let us get famous on Instagram. I'm going to get famous on fat Instagram. <laughs> Do you know that? The southern drawl diabetes? Is that, is that true? You know, I couldn't tell you, but it's not our job to present the facts here. I googled southern drawl diabetes, and the first result says type 1 diabetes humor on Pinterest. <laughs> so maybe I'm on the wrong track, but that's kind of amazing. I, I don't love know if Pinterest, I want to look man. They've got the best search engine optimization. Like, can you imagine? Like, you just typed in the most random bullshit. I could type in, like, cottage cheese narcotics, and I'm sure you'd get, like, 5,000 <laughs> pins. I, I hate Pinterest for that because I never know what the hell is on their website. <laughs> it's, like, it's always like, log in, log in to see yep. it. It's like, why don't you make log in, like, one more action, like, like share or, like, print or something. Like, make it, like, I don't know what it is yet. <laughs> it's, yeah, they need to bring you in, man, because once you're in, you know, then they have your data. And uh, Do you know anyone with a Pinterest? Oh, I know tons of people with Pinterest. It's like once you have Pinterest, oh, really? you have Instagram, you have like all these social media things that interact and like send you more ads. I was going to say like I know like 30 people who are like I'm going to become an influencer. But like I don't know anyone who's like and I'm going to do it through Pinterest. No. It's all no. Like Instagram. Yeah, no, it's got to be Instagram, right? Like no one yeah. yeah, you go to you go to Pinterest if your idea is to like crochet blankets, you know. You're like I'm going to teach yeah. people how to like crochet uh, a hat. You know, that's where you go for for Pinterest. No one is clicking on that shit on Instagram. They're like I want to see Kylie Jenner and uh the other Jenner and one of the Kardashians and I want to see them all together in the same photo. And uh, then Pinterest, I like it. Pin, Pinterest is like it, they give you like hobbies to help you through your mental illness that you got from Instagram. Ah, damn! That's that's the connection like, exactly. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I saw one of the Kardashians crocheting, and that's why I'm talking about this. You're like a 15 year old girl, and you're like, oh, I want to be insta famous, and then you're like, oh, I am. Just kind of average looking, like you know, ninety nine percent of people. Your Instagram is not gonna work, and then you look at all these other girls, and you start editing yours, and then you get you know some eating disorder, and then you just want to crochet fucking blankets, and you go to Pinterest, okay? It's maybe you grow some house plants or something. You join a Facebook group where you call people Latinx. I don't know. Yeah, it's the real hero's journey. Um... I, I will say, though, that um, I remember when, you know, I was in college or, or something, or maybe I was just starting to, you know, work after school. And I remember, you know, when Instagram was, like, getting really big and, like, everybody was on it. And I remember just, like, I, you know, I had it at one point and I was just kind of browsing and I was like, wow, these people are all beautiful, you know? And then you're like... What the? You're 16. You look like you're like a 28 yeah. model for Giorgio Armani. And then you're like, I feel like a sack of shit. Like I'm never gonna look right. as good as this 16 year old piece of shit. <laughs> you know, just like fr from genetics, from like nothing you've done. And I can never monetize that. And it's just such a crazy right. feeling to me to be like, and there are thousands of them. Like look at my feed. You know, it's like basically a you right. know a catalog of beautiful people. I want I want a Pinterest where beautiful people or uh, an Instagram where beautiful people are not allowed. I want everybody to be average. I <laughs> want like a Instagram. panel of ugly people weighing in and approving or denying. And you know, <laughs> <laughs> I'm serious, man. And like, let's say they hit like a growth spurt, they hit puberty, and suddenly they're good looking. They're out. They're out. They're not allowed anymore. That's what, what I would want. you call it instead of like Instagram, like Insta Kilo <laughs> for fat people or something. <laughs> I don't know, like Fatgram or like. You know, the B Ugly squad. Book. Yeah, just, you know. Ugly book, yeah. Bang energy drink. Like, whatever, you know, just to show that it's, like, not the best quality to look at or <laughs> experience. That's what I want. Instead of I want to feel, Yeah, I want everyone to feel good about themselves. Like, I want, um, I want, like, the Dove. You remember the Dove commercials? I want, like, those, you know, of just, like, average-looking people wearing underwear. Oh, see, that's where we differ. I want them on the Ugly Twitter or whatever. Or, like, I want them on... Um, grotesque deformant uh, Pinterest, whatever you want to call it. 
and I don't. I want them to feel bad about it. Oh wow! I want them to think about. I want them to think about how they're there all the time, like Parlor. I want them to be like, they won't let us get famous on Instagram. I'm gonna get famous on fat Instagram. Like they all are. They all have affiliate links for Dove. <laughs> We can call it like average gram. I don't know. All I'm saying is average I'm looking gram. for funding and I am flexible on equity.